Norway warm lighting. Right. Give you a name and yeah. The, the uh, washed out the better. Norway. Yeah. <laughs> so are you guys, do you guys usually sing like in the shower, in the car? Are you those kind of people? Yeah, we, we, um, I'm a big car singer. I'm a big car singer, yeah. yeah. I'm always like looking around at people driving by, hoping that people are singing Do, as well. But they're not. They're, no one is ever singing anymore. No. Mm -mm. I, I, I Do hope that. you focus on driving or something. Ugh, yeah. yeah. Do people stop singing in cars? Yeah, you know how when you're driving and you're just yeah. like in the zone and you look over and they're just like looking back at you and you're just like, you should probably be singing the same song, too, right? But they're not. Yeah. You know, I don't know. I have as not much everyone song. can no. have as much fun, I guess. So, I feel like these girls in the movie, they have like difficulties maybe fitting in everywhere. Did, did you guys ever have that experience that it was, you didn't feel that you fit in somewhere? Can you relate to that? Yes, I, I mean, I still do sometimes. Yeah. Um, I, I feel like that's what's really great about this movie is that it's showcasing all these different personalities and, and, um, and how unique they are. And I think that all of us, even as people, not even as our characters, have had that in some way, and I think that that's why girls really relate to it, and people, you know, even guys, relate to it as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You too. Yeah. No. I think I think no matter where you are in the world, or or what your profession is, or how old you are, there's always that element um, of sort of not feeling like you fit in or belong or whatever. Um, but I think the beauty of this movie is that these girls kind of find that place and find the people that they can surround themselves with and and, and be themselves. Uh, which again, like Bernie said, I think is a huge reason why so many people relate to this movie. And I think they're great role models for, for young girls mm -hmm. too. Is that something that you think about? I mean, you guys are role models too now. Is that scary to think about? Yeah, it is. Right? It, like is weird... uh, it is scary um, in the way of like if we were trying to be anything that we're not. I think, right. um, I think the, the great thing about um, about being an actor is the fact that we can reach so many people and hopefully if we're just who we are um, and stay true to that, then people, you know, will, um, you know, I don't know, like that. I, yeah. I don't, I don't, try not to think about it too much or else you just, yeah. you can't. A little scary probably to think about, especially when, I mean, you're so young too. <laughs> is that, I mean, are you, you're just 18, right? Mm -hmm. And you're growing up as a teenager in like, the public eye and everything is yeah. that you know is that a little scary thing um i think it's as scary as we make it um for me i think i i am constantly reminded and constantly remind myself that i'm very fortunate to be able to do what i love and what i love is making movies um and i think that that's that's what it's about for me is making really great movies and and everything that kind of comes along is, comes with it. Is there anything you miss about being, because I think you're homeschooled, right? I am, yeah. Is there anything you miss when you look at this movie and the, the bonding they have in, in their school? Is there anything that you you think that? Not necessarily. I have, I, I still keep in touch with all my friends from school. I see them all the time and um, I get to make movies like this where I, I play a freshman in college when I'd be a freshman in college <laughs> and um, yeah, 